Hello, dear role players. Tired of character AI's filters, slow responses, or just plain boring replies? Yeah, we all are. But today, everything changes. OpenAI just dropped what might be the most powerful LLM in history, GPT-5. And no, this isn't just a slightly better chat GPT update. They went crazy with this release. And it honestly looks like Sam Altman has been thinking about role players too, because they finally added the Persona box. That's right, you can now give GPT-5 a full character sheet, backstory, personality, speaking style, and it stays in character consistently. It's basically character AI on steroids, but with actual memory. And speaking of memory, GPT-5 runs with a massive 400k context window. Not theoretical, as some models claim. I'm talking about consistent memory that doesn't just cut your story halfway through. Plus, it's not as heavily filtered as character AI. You can swear. You can write fight scenes. You can go dark. You can have actual dramatic tension without hitting a wall. Just a quick note. OpenAI has a free tier with a limited number of messages, and their subscription gives you unlimited messages. But if you're not into using OpenAI directly, here's the good news. OpenRouter just added GPT-5. They have OpenAI GPT-5 Nano API with a 400K context window. Think of it as a slightly smaller version of full GPT-5, but still way better than GPT-4.0. The price? Absurdly cheap for what it offers. Here's how it works. Input, 5 cents per 1 million tokens. Output, 40 cents per 1 million tokens. Yes, that's per 1 million tokens, not per message. To put it in perspective, for 45 cents total, you can send and receive roughly 750,000 words with this model. Many people get this wrong and think each reply costs 40 cents. It doesn't. One average reply might cost you around $0.00001. So if you can spare two to three dollars, throw it into open router, put API key into chub.ai and try this beast. They also have OpenAI GPT-5 Mini, a bit more expensive but still totally worth it. And of course, the full GPT-5, which is the premium option. Yes, the model has filters, but they're nowhere near as restrictive as character AI or Claude, so you can enjoy those long, open-world RPs without constantly hitting a wall. This might be the closest thing we've had to AGI so far. DeepSeek, Claude, Grok, they're all going to have to respond to this. Now, let's talk tech language. What's the deal with GPT-5? It's a unified AI system that knows when to think fast and when to think deep, which is insane. It's got a real-time router and a thinking mode you can manually trigger. It cuts hallucinations by up to 80%. Compared to GPT-4.0, which is all about lightning-fast responses and real-time voice, and to DeepSeek R1, a raw, open-source reasoning monster, GPT-5 actually feels like it has a brain. The chain of thought this thing can run is absolutely wild. So tell me, will you jump on GPT-5 for your long fantasy role plays, or will you stick with DeepSeek and the other free models? Drop your thoughts in the comments, and as always, happy role playing.